I'm Granny Petro, and I always want to tell you what's good about oil and coal and good times. I've been following Greta and all of her angry teenage friends over there on Twitter saying mean things, but Greta, I respectfully disagree. On one of your tweets, you retweeted a Mika Rantatin who wrote, you should never underestimate Siberian summer, but 35.5 degrees Celsius inside Arctic Circle in May feels truly exceptional. Arctic heat wave. Oh, Greta, heat is good for ice. Heat makes the Arctic circles run free, Greta. All of that glaciers are angry, frozen. They want warmth to have fun. Don't you like going to the beach, Greta? So do polar bears, Greta. Don't be so angry at your elders, Greta. Always shaming them, making them feel bad. Warm is fun. The Arctic Circle, maybe they can have a beach party. Science has told us, Greta, that melting ice is actually good. And ice doesn't melt because of oil, Greta. Those are crazy lies told you by the big kale lobby and the salad consortium. We've known this, that the spinach lobby has been pushing this for years. Little mom and pop oil companies just trying to get by, and you're mean and angry with them, Greta. Why do you post things like this, Greta, with your angry teenage friends? Germany is opening a new coal power plant this summer. It's run by Finnish state-owned Fortum. Swedish state-owned Vattenfall is already operating new coal plants in Germany. Everyone involved claims to be climate leaders, but this is the opposite of leadership. This is failure. While the world is moving away from dirty coal consumption, the German government decided to stack, stick to coal in 2038. Oh, Greta, why are you so angry at coal? You children today are so angry and mad at coal. Back in my day, children enjoyed playing coal. Look at that fun child playing in coal, enjoying himself, having a wonderful time. Greta, why are you so angry at coal? We know now that coal is actually good for your teeth and healthy. While I just bought a new tube of coal paste. It is delicious, Greta. Coal actually makes your teeth better and brighter. First, we just put a little coal paste right on our teeth, just like that. Look at that, Greta. That's good for your teeth. This is how. Don't, don't let the... Don't let Big Green lie to you, Greta, telling you that you don't need coal on your teeth. It's good. Look at this young man. He used to brush his whole face and body with coal. But then the hippies came in and said that coal was bad, took away his joy and his fun, made him go play in parks and all these things children don't want to do. Children want to play in coal. Look, Greta. Mm. Oh, this tastes coalicious. Mm. Make sure you get the coal in between your teeth. You don't want your teeth to be too white and crazy looking. Now, rinse your mouth out. This is clear natural gas fracking fluid. Mm, look, nice.
nice grey coal teeth. Remember, Greta, make coal paste a part of your daily routine. Stop being angry. Be a fun, happy coal child. This is Granny Petrol saying so long and don't let the kale lobby keep you down with their lies. Always hurting you. Big Green is out to get you. Support a mom and pop coal plant. And small business owners like Exxon Mobil and Shell, good mom and pop businesses, keeping a world going and children happy playing in coal. This is Granny Petrol saying goodbye. Hey everybody, like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification button and the subscribe button, even if you've done it before because they're unsubscribing many of you every day. Watch the ads all the way through. If you click skip ad, I don't get paid. Also, support us at patreon.com slash Graham Elwood or rockfin.com slash Graham Elwood. Rockfin.com is a blockchain cryptocurrency platform. All my videos are on Rockfin ad free. Thanks for watching.